Can we all just take a moment to appreciate how goddamn cute this little guy is? Look at him! That is not even fair how adorable he is! Oh, no one has got to cuddle fish! I just want to cuddle you forever! Ah! G'day, guys! My name's Josh! You can call me Job Wordle and welcome back to Subnautica. We are back playing the underwater adventure game because I was doing some editing and I have gone wrong, gone wrong with my best already. I was doing some editing and I realized uh, that when I was over at the at the, the disco ball reef, which I think is called the Grand Reef, when I was over at the Grand Reef fighting off the giant squid fuckers, there were rubies sticking out of the walls all around the entranceway to that place. So I'm going to go back there because I need the ruby to get my depth upgrade for the sea moth so I can keep going exploring deeper and darker places. Um, so I'm gonna go all the way back. Oh, wait, where was it? Was it that one over there? Uh, I think it was. Yeah, I think it's that. I have to go all the way back over there uh, and get some rubies and then come back to here to then go and make some upgrades. The other thing that I've decided, because I, you know, making decisions isn't my strong suit, you know? Like, I spend a lot of time umming and ahhing and just kind of, like, being an idiot. But the other thing that I've decided is that my submarine will hereby be known as Simon. Specifically because it has a male voice in it. Like, everything else here has a female voice. Like, Sammy the Sea Moth has a female voice. The bass, like, the, vo the voice in my head and the, ba the bass voice is all female. Simon has a male voice. So you are going to be... Simon. What? No, that's how I do it. Shit. Where is it? Show me your name, Simon. Come on. I know. I know. There you are. I'm going to have to put that in capitals. Simon the Submarine. It's painted on the side. It's official. Uh, there's the entrance. God damn. I always, I always forget when I actually get back into this thing. All right, Simon. You and me, we're going on an adventure. All right. There's the big dark hole. The big scary hole. Oh, shit. I've almost run my, uh, my Simon straight into a wall. Sorry about that, Simo. All right. Jump in here. Let's go find ourselves some ruby. Now, I, I noticed, like... When I was looking at it in editing, God, I really did almost hit a wall there, didn't I? Uh, yeah, when I noticed in the editing, it was like literally right in front of my face. It was glowing red, and I just didn't notice it at the time, because I'm an idiot. Which means, uh, maybe if I turn the lights off, I can see the red glow again? I don't know, we're, we're gonna- we're gonna find it, we're gonna love it, we're gonna get our stuff, and we're gonna go deep into sea moth. Oh, oh, there's something red! There it is. There's the- okay, it wasn't quite as easy as I was hoping to be. I know they're around here somewhere. There is the ruby I've been looking for. Oh, thank God. All right, yeah, I had to I had to search around a little bit more than I was ho I was expecting to, because turns out they are they weren't actually in the. Oh, there's another one right there. See, look now, it's always the thing. I've been looking for ages for one of them, and now I found one. They're just gonna show up everywhere. All right, they are they're definitely better to search for at night because they they kind of glow uh, in the daytime, much harder to see. But yeah, they, they weren't they weren't in where I thought they were gonna be at all. They were like all the way back at like the main entrance to the underground cave bit. Oh, it took me ages to find it. I've got my rubies. I've got my Simon. Time to go home and get another depth upgrade for my uh, my sea moth, so I can keep going deeper. There's a lot of uh, a lot of driving back and forth in this thing. There's uh, not a lot of exploring anymore. It's just traversing the col like a couple of kilometers between here and my base. It takes a very fucking long time. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Was that a wreck? How have I not seen this before? It's like between me and the Grand Reef. How did I never, did I never come across this? I, I, the, the surf's off always going to the surface and never like exploring down below. All right, Sammy, we've got a job to do. We have to go explore something. It's been a long time since I had a new wreck to explore. This is, I mean, I haven't got a whole lot of new areas because I keep having to try and like upgrade my shit so I can go to the new areas. But like, this is, this is, this feels good. I haven't, I haven't done this in a while. What is this? There's a there's a data box outside the wreck. I've only been here for like three seconds. What do you got for me? Oh, wait, what did that say? Cyclops death module? There's just one of these kicking around over here? What the shit? Okay, how do I how do I make one of those? What where's where where is it gonna be? Is it in here somewhere? Where is it? Cyclops death module mark one plus your ingot three rubies. Well, I mean, thank god I've got a bunch of rubies on me, because that's I'd be really annoying if I found that I couldn't make it. There's other things around here to scan as well. What are you? Thermal plant fragment. I think I've already got a thermal plant. I don't know. I'm going to keep scanning shit anyway. I want everything this, this wreck has to give me. Ah, there's the entrance. So I get the light lined up so I can actually see when I go in there. There we go. Thank you, Sammy. Right, if that's the kind of cool shit they've got hanging around outside, what kind of cool shit are we going to, going to find inside? Where's my where's my torch? Do I still have my torch on me? Yeah, I do. All right, let's 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 go in. Deep and dark. Let's have a look around. I'm, I'm excited by this. I love finding new shit. Oh, I see another data box. I see another data box. What do you got for me? Repulsion cannon. Wait, do I, have... I already have a repulsion cannon, don't I? I'm pretty sure I do. What was a fucking waste? Yeah, I did. Just gave me titanium. 
Oh, I mean, I've already got that. You don't need to inform me about that anymore. Is there anything else in here? Did I come? I had to cut through two fucking doors to get to that thing. Is that all you're going to give me? Oh, there's another thing. There's another little passage. Where's the passage going to lead? I'm excited. Where's it going to take me? Where's it going to take me? Take me somewhere good. Give me something good. You're not going to give me anything, are you? It's going to take me outside. It's going to be a waste of fucking time. Uh, no, there's a bunch of prawn suit arms. That's fine. We've got the prawn suit. Yeah, scan it anyway. There we go. Oh, it's the drill arm. I've got 30 seconds of oxygen. Yes, I know. You're a bit late on that one. Shit, shit, shit. Okay, I need to, need to get out. Need to get out. Need to get out. Need to move quick. Come on, Joshy boy. Oh, shit. I died a long way from home. Oh, I got so distracted by cutting doors. Where am I now? Oh, I'm just on, I'm just on assignment. All right, that's not so bad. Oh, thank God. I was going to spawn back at my base, and I was like, God, it's going to take me eight fucking years to get all the way back there. That's a very annoying. All right, back in we go. Pick up all my rubies again. Can't leave that shit behind. My titanium's outside the door. Ow, 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 ow. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> I'm stuck. Oh, I can't. I'm stuck in the wall. No, get me out of here. All right, okay, we're back. We've got a whole bunch of stuff in there, actually. So, like, I went back in a couple more times, found a couple more things. Uh, what have I got? I've got Cyclops Docking Bay Repair Module, which I repair to on copper wire. I can make one of those. Anything else with the glowing yellow thing? There it is. Oh, that's already got one of those. Uh, well, there was another cool thing I found. Where where the hell did it go? Wait for it. Wait for it. Everyone, everyone wait for it. Oh, the, the, oh, I've got the... I can now make all of those things. Kyanite, nickel ore. I could probably... I might be able to find nickel straight away, actually. I think I might have seen nickel somewhere. Um, anything else here? No, but it must have been something. I'm just forgetting shit. Oh, there it is. The prawn suit drill arm. I went and found another fragment of that. So I can make one of those as well. Lithium and diamond. I can make one of those straight away. I, but I still don't... I haven't actually made a prawn suit yet. I should probably get on that shit. That's the wrong button. There we go. All right. Let's get Sammy back in Simon and, uh, make a little love. No, <laughs> just get back to base. Make some more shit. Go into some deep holes. Ah, uh, home sweet home. Sammy is docked in my little, uh, moon pool. All right. How do I make things? Wait, is this where I need to make it? Oh, that's right. Use fabricator. That's where it is. Uh, torpedoes, seamoth modules. Where do I? No, wait, wait. What? Where? Oh, wait. Is it in the modification? There's like three different crafting areas in this game, and I always forget which one does which. God, my base looks cool. Um, is it in here? I'm pretty sure it's in the modification station. Yes, it is. There it is. All right. Um, should I need to go get the depth module out of, out of a Sammy? Plus the lingot, magnetite, enamel glass. I have all of those things. I just need to go get it all. Come on, titanium ingots. Get some lithium. Get a bunch of those. There we go. That should be enough. All right. Let's go make this shit. Uh, I read the wrong thing before. I was reading the Mark II. I want the Mark III, which is there. Oh, I need to actually make the plastic ingot. For God's sake. Plastic ingot. Make one of those. All right. Now, I've got like four plastic ingots. That should be enough for me to make whatever I need to do. There was what? There was the Cyclops... Shit, do I need to go get the depth module out of the Cyclops as well? Did I fuck up? Did I leave some things behind that I needed? Anyway, that's the thing that I need there. The depth module for Sammy. Thank you very much. And I do need to go get it. Oh, Kyanite. Where the fuck am I going to find Kyanite? I don't know, but I, when I do, I'm going to come back. That's going to be very, very exciting. Plus, I'm thinking, oh, it's a nickel ore for that. Well, what needed the fucking... What was the other thing that needed rubies? Oh, it was the depth module. All right, well, where do I where do I make one of those? Plus, I'm ruby three. Is It's not in there. Uh, it's gonna be down at the modifications. No, not the modifications. The the vehicle modification. This thing down here. Whatever this is called. What the hell is this thing called again? Um, are, are you uh vehicle upgrade console? All right. Are you gonna be in here? Is this where I'm? No. Where the where the where the dick do I find all this shit? Cyclops upgrade fabricator. I had to come all the way out here to Simon to actually like make his own bloody uh, death module. For God's sake, this, uh, that's a fourth different crafter. There's first, so many different things everywhere in this goddamn place. All right, what uh, what else do I... What, what, what can I make? What do I need to make the second round of that? This uh, dust module 2, nickel ore. Have I found nickel? I, f I think I found nickel. I just can't remember where it is. No, I've got no nickel. Well, I must have uh, just uh, forgotten that. I may have thinking of something else. I don't know. I'm going to go check on my little egg to see if he's, uh, he's hatched yet. Because uh, he's been in there a little while. <gasps> what the hell is that? He's adorable! Oh, what are you? I want to be your best friend. Oi, oi, you're like, you're like, you're like a jellyfish octopus thing. I don't know what you are. I'm coming in. I'm coming in to be friends. Can we be best friends? Hello? Pick up cuttlefish. He's a cuttlefish! Can we all just take a moment to appreciate how goddamn cute this little guy is? Look at him! That is not even fair how adorable he is. Oh, no one has got a cuttlefish. I just want to cuddle you forever. Ah! A small grey coloured herbivore, the cuttlefish displays high levels of intelligence, curiosity, and attachment. Strangely, this species has not been encountered in the wild, and the scanned specimen had to be artificially hatched within the alien containment unit. How did you know that? 
How did how what? How did you know that was a thing? Um, can I there's a tell me in here, uh, assessment emotional connection between living creatures is an essential component for psychological health. So this is just like my this is that's why it's called a cuttlefish. This is just my best friend. Can I can I can I play with you? Can can we play? Can we play together? Look at you, you I mean, you're not particularly attractive, but like Nah, I'm kidding. You're adorable. Come here. It said he's a herbivore, and I don't think there's much in here for him. So I'm gonna quickly go get some kelp uh, and uh, give him something to eat. Cause I can't, I can't have my new best friend starving to death because I uh, didn't get him the right kind of food to eat. All right, let's just get some of these and just go like, ah, uh, ah, uh, creep vine. Give it a creep vine. There we go. All right, I'm coming. I'm coming, buddy. I'm coming. I didn't, now I need to think of a name for this guy. God. Damn it. Actually, you know what? He's a cuttlefish. Start to the sea. You are Charlie the cuttlefish. Hey, Charlie. All right, here we go. Uh, use planter. Where? Okay, plant this. Switch container. There we go. Do I have to like go around to different different places and plant different bits, parts of creep vine? Is that what's going on? No, just anywhere. Okay, there we go. Boom. Four creep vines. That'll grow. Charlie can eat. You gorgeous little man. I've made an extra repair tool so that I can make. Well, I didn't know I didn't even read what it was. That's the thing that, uh, this thing. There are Cyclops, uh, docking bay repair module. God, I couldn't read that for some reason. So now I can, re oh, that's a giant spinning turbine of death. Let's not go that way. Now I can repair Sammy when she's docked inside Simon and she can be a happy little sea moth. All right, you go in there, equip. There we go. Boom. So you, everything's going well there. That's fine. I have, I've taken a bunch of valuable shit with me. That was dumb. Uh, this one? Yeah, that one. All right, let's put these things away. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. All right, let's go and explore something deeper and darker than what I have been already. I'm excited. We're going to new places. So now I have the problem where... Oh, hello, dude. How you doing? Oh, I have no idea where I'm actually supposed to be going. I, oh, shit. Oh, oh, you fuck. You big fucking... Li oh, my God. There we go. Power's back on. I'm just going down. As much as I can, I'm just going down. I don't know whereabouts I'm supposed to be going. But uh, that looks like a cave over there. I'm literally, I've just gone past the base down here and I'm just trying my best to avoid getting fucked up by these stupid EMP firing squid Jeffries. There we go. Ow, ow, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just, I'm sorry. I just need a quick get down here. I'm sure, I'm sure there's very good reasons for me to stay out there, but I'm not hanging around. Where, what the shit? What is this? What the fuck? This is awesome! I'm gonna assume I've gone the right way because I found a new biome. It's like, it's all like foggy and like acidic. It's like the whole world is covered in like acid. That's crazy. All right, how's my, how's my dude doing? Are you, are you hurting? You're not hurting too bad. Everything seems pretty okay. All right, let's, let's keep going. Just keep swimming or just keep submarining. Come on, Simon. It's you, you, me and Sammy. We got this. Hey, giant, like, random manta ray. Can I, can I hit you and kill you? <laughs> Ow! Get off my windshield! This place is like a maze. I don't... I, actually, you know what? I'm going to get out and go explore it. Because I don't actually know where I'm going. I've just been going straight the whole bloody time. See him off. How you doing? You're at full health because you've got a, a, a healing kit now. All right. What? Well, there's got to be... There's got to be something good for me around here somewhere. Is that... Is this like... This looks like it's going to kill me. And I don't particularly want to test that theory. Because I'm pretty sure... Oh, my God! What the fuck? There's a giant rib cage here. Oh, what is that? Oh my god. It's, this is all this is all getting pretty crazy. Simon, you hang out over there for a second. I just need to go quickly investigate. Is that a giant fucking skull? What? Where What there's like spotlights? What of what is this? Alright, this is crazy. The music's gone all like in intense as well. There's a giant fuck off skull here with like like, you know, like in, uh, in Spider-Man 2, like, uh, Doc, is it, uh, oh, Doc Ock in his fucking stupid tentacles? Is there's, like, Doc Ock tentacles all over this place. What is happening here? Why, what am I, what am I actually looking at? I don't, I don't know, but it's so, is that a door? Wait, what is, what is going on? What is this place? That is definitely a door. It's like a force field. You know, like, in, in uh, in Star Wars Episode 1, where, like, the, in the, in the Darth Maul battle, where, like, Obi-Wan and, uh, uh, Darth Maul and Qui-Gon Jinn get separated by, like, the big, like, force fields. That's the same thing. There's something separating me from something exciting in there. And I want to know what it is. Um, can I... I can't get out and swim around. I know I'm past 100 meters. Shut up. Can I... Oh, What are you? Oh! You're the... Insert tablet. The orange tablet. Is that... Did I leave that on... On my... On my Cyclops? 
I think I might have. It's all the way over there. I have to go check. I have to go check. I might have brought that with me if I did. I'm a fucking genius. There's something down there, but I don't want to go into like the misty death to... Oh, it's uh, disappeared. All right, that was a bit trippy. Oh, I know it's there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and go for it anyway. <sighs> go, go, go! Ow, 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 ow! Pick up, pick up crystalline sulfur, whatever that was. Get out! Oh my god, that fucked me up so much. What the hell even was that? What did I get? Crystalline sulfur. Uh, okay, well that that better be important because if that if I just like lost most of my health, I think I got a, he a health back on the on the cyclops somewhere back on Simon. If I lost most of my health for no goddamn reason, I'd be pissed. Can I like go into this thing? Jesus Christ, this thing is huge! I should probably scan this thing. Ancient skeleton. Oh, get closer. Ancient skeleton. There we go. How does my little handheld scanner scan this whole thing, by the way? That's, that's a pretty impressive feat. Super, like, high advanced technology. Ancient fossilized skeleton. What is this? Uh, the skeleton of a million year old armored carnivore. Projections uh, suggest this life form would have been larger than any living creature encountered on the planet. The oceans of the time would have been very different to support life forms of this size, with more open geography and many more individuals of the, in the Leviathan range. Good, I'm glad this thing's dead. If this thing was, uh, if I had to fight one of the, like, look at this thing. That thing's bigger than my fucking Simon. That's ridiculous. Alien sensor. I've been distracted by scanning everything. Like, everything here is super important. I need to know everything that it can tell me. Research probes. The prominence and, and facing of these alien devices suggest they are some kind of probe or sensor. The subject would seem to be the vast skeleton in the center of the cavern. The attached cable network may lead to a remote power station or data hub. Uh, assessment investigate. What's, what? Oh, it's a Reginald. Hey, Reginald. How you doing? Um... Uh, right. Well, I guess I have to keep going deeper into this thing. I need, I need, I should first I'm gonna go scan these things. I want to scan everything. I want to know as much information as I can possibly get. You, anything? No, you're just a fucking light. Okay, makes sense. Ah, uh, god damn it! I didn't bring my orange tablet. I'm gonna have to go all the way back home to get that piece of shit and come all the way back here. That is gonna take me eight million years. Oh. Damn it. Alright, well, I'm gonna have to come back and continue this, uh, this adventure into wherever the hell I am in the next episode. Because I, I just don't have time to go all the way back and all the way back here in this episode. So I'll come back and get through that force field in the next episode. Because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, make sure the like button down below and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. If I don't talk to you there first, I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.